Hey guys, what is going on here today? And welcome back to a bit of a different video on my channel, guys. And today it's going to be live trading. So we're going to get into it now. This episode should be around eight or nine minutes long. Um, but yeah, we've got a 5.9 mil to play with. Obviously, not going to spend anywhere near that. I'm just going to go and pick out some certain methods that I do actually do quite a lot and just explain them to you a little bit and pick up some deals as well using the inform method and a few other things like that. But the first one here is a left forward, right forward method. I'm sure you've all seen this before. It is one of my favourite methods. All you want to do is just search in players left forward and right forward at 1.3k and try and find some deals. This is about 6 in the morning when the servers are good. That's why I recorded this. It should be out around 6pm probably on the... Um, Thursday evening so yeah if you have enjoyed this video guys or are enjoying it make sure you do smash that like button if you can hit 10 likes that would be amazing and yeah make sure you subscribe as well thank you so much for 1.3k subscribers let's go on to 1.4k now that would be awesome now we're doing a Hunter Catalyst Shadow and Anchor Method we put them all in at about 1.4k and then the Anchor at 1k though and Hunter a little bit extra but all you want to do is just search through and look for the decent ones you'll get used to it in the end which ones sell and which ones don't and then now guys we're just doing some the next method is going to be the position change method. So this one here, you pick up here though guys, I'm just showing here as an example. These Mertens are so cheap, 2.1k, you can pick that one up, uh, probably that 2k one there as well, and the next one for 2.1 or whatever, 1.7, 2k and 2.4, you can bid on that one as well. If you pick all them up, you will sell them off like 4k, and I'm not even joking, they will actually sell in the end. Like They're so, so good to trade with, like these kind of players, I mean, when the markets are kind of crashed no one really thinks about them and they're so so easy to sell on like they will sell on so easy in the end that's all you want to do then we're going here now to do the MLS thing this is basically a new method like if you've got quite a few followers on Twitter that trust you and whatever and like buy an extra like for extra money or just tweet them out anyway a lot of people still buy the card you want to just look for basically any card that's extinct on the market and just search so obviously not players like obviously you want the team of the season from the MLS mainly now there's a lot of hype around them I've been selling them on Twitter quite a bit I'm sure you already know if you do actually follow me on Twitter but yeah you can see here now like Robbie Keane and stuff like that you pick them up, I mean I told this Robbie Keane on that I did get in a minute you'll see in a second I do try and get a Robbie Keane there we go yeah and I got that and I sold that on for 90k which is 10k profit on Twitter so yeah that's all you want to do and then you list it up and then hope they get it if not then you lose 15k but they still made a chance to get another one that's basically all that happens uh, a lot of spinning around there and there he is we're going to store him into transfer list and I sold him on at a later time tried to get Seaman here sadly though guys I um, didn't actually get him as um he expired before, so obviously I went in there, probably already up for a couple of seconds, I didn't manage to actually get him. But now we're going to do silvers, and this basically all I'm doing, like, I'm only going to show you now for a couple of seconds. All I want to do is just like put up 40k, something like that, look, 40k is the most expensive player is that, so you want to put it up to over 40k, so you go to 42.50 here, now you just want to surge up and down, like around that kind of price, just to um, try and find some players, any silver player can snipe them, and they sell on for more than the gold, because they are actually much rarer pick up on the market and stuff like that so uh, the top tip there if you want to do that but yeah next here guys um the next thing you should do is to look at players like Sanchez in form or normal Sanchez's so you can go and like snipe these in the 59th minute you're going to put in like 12k so go all the way to Alexis Sanchez here and put in 12k so there we go like you can see the cheapest is 12k two of them are up on the market and we scroll it down to 10.5k and we just refresh it like this over and over see if we can pick up any deals here so we're just searching and searching like obviously I'm not going to get anything, it's 5.30 in the morning but I'm just giving you an example, we'll probably just pick one up by now or actually see one on the market um, in that time because they do come up really really like often so that's pretty awesome to do but yeah guys we have 5.7 million you can see um, we've got a lot of coins that I don't have to trade with but at this time it's not really deals to pick up, I'm just showing you some methods basically as a live trading thing I don't know how often there's a run, if you do want to see this more often make sure you say down below, that would be awesome because um, that is something that I do want to try a bit more often do some live trading you can directly see what I'm doing then rather than me actually doing it for a video and then like explaining it in there you can see now I've got like 8 minutes just to talk about the methods and stuff like that you can put in that like, Ozil there, CDM, like convert it again from a cam to a CDM this time a lot of um, bids in there as well um, they're really easy to pick up, you should pick some of them up really if you see them, any player you want, yeah I could do it with just flares like that now we're going to look at some informed players, so first we're going to look at Christian Tello um, this guy's a right wing for um, FC Porto, I think so. Yeah, we go and search him up here, and then um, yeah, 12k. I was tempted to pick that up, but I looked at it and just thought, will it really sell though? And my overall opinion was no, it probably won't. So I didn't bother picking it up. And then now we're going to look at um, Sigurdsson here, 19k50. I see 15k. I went and picked that up, and that has sold on now, guys. You'll see it's up. It sold on within the first probably 40 minutes, 30 minutes. That sold on, which is a great profit to be honest. Um, 
not a massive amount, but it's still probably could have a lot of players. That is an easy amount of coins that you have made there. And then now we go back in here, now we search some more farms up. So I think next we go and yeah, do um, we're just looking for three players here. And um, yeah, we do Leighton Baines next. Uh, yeah, there's Leighton Baines and um, 93k on the market, pretty cheap, but not good enough for a trading deal. If it's for a team, I think that'd be a pretty good deal. I don't know why there was Sanchez there. I think we went to look for them form, but then realised it was quite expensive. So I didn't actually bother looking in the end. I want to look for cheaper players, like obviously players um. Mark Hampson can form all team of the teams in the man of the match or whatever it is. Uh, so there's any deals or whatever. Sadly, there's no deals again, um, which is a bit of a shame, but yeah, at the end of the day, we'll can move on from that. And we go and check out uh, Drew's Mertens here, um, looking mainly for the man of the match card. Only one up on the market, a very, very, very expensive price that I don't find to pick one up for, to be honest. So we do actually leave that one there. Sorry about the train there, guys, as well. Sorry, I'd have managed to a train there, I don't already know. It is constant, there's nothing I can do about it. I've recorded this three times now and I actually give up because I haven't really got much time to do this anymore. My throat is starting to really hurt. So, yeah, you can have to just deal with that train there, sorry. And then we look at Man of the Match Bonnie, he's looking really in forms. Finally, now I think this is another last few that we do. We do actually look at Christian Eriksen, and you can see now um, 100k, so that would be an awesome deal for the pink card. But yeah, that's a very, very good deal. I mean, and it's in a good position too. Now, guys, we go and look at. Um, I think, I can't remember who it is now, actually to be honest with you, um, no it's gone from there, I don't know who it was, I think, oh it was Lima, there we go, 20k, 17k, no deals there, very rare on the market, that guy, um, quite an early team of the week he was in, so obviously he's not really seen on the market anymore, which is pretty good, um, if you're a bit of an extinct trader, something like that, I'm pretty easy to pick up once again to sell on for more. We are approaching this video now guys, so if you have seen this, make sure you comment down below, comment MLS in the um, comments, I know you've got here, pretty random thing, but see here as well, Lee Gunduk, um, yeah, 13.5k, what a deal, and you'll see now, um, this is basically the end of the video, so thank you so much for watching, if you have enjoyed, make sure you smash the like button, comment down below guys, subscribe if you are new around here, let's try and push on to 1400 subscribers, it should be absolutely awesome, but you can see now, look, the server's are raids, and then this happens, he just disappears for a bit, I can tell you now that I have actually got him for 13.5k, and I did sell him for 18,000, or 17,750 on the bid, something like that, it sold within the first hour that I listed it in, um, yeah, for the price of the bid, so, yeah guys, that is it, though, like I said, thank you so much for watching, if you have enjoyed, smash the like button, if you can actually smash 15 likes, guys, I'll bring another one of these out in the next couple of days, um, but yeah, let me know down below if you want me to do it or not, thank you anyway, and I'll see you all, and bye.